Hey everybody and welcome back to Leo's Fortune. It's been a little while since I played this game, but what I do remember is the sticks don't work. We already did that last time. The sticks don't work and um, it's all D-pad for this game. So there was, yep, and square falls faster. Okay. All right, and I remember I have not died in this game yet. Oh, that was almost a death there. So it's like, yep, yep. Yep. And I remember <clears throat> thinking that, oh, this game, oh, wasn't so tricky for that part. But here is where they introduce the mechanic of. I. Oh. Uh, start yes <clears throat> and the nice part is I don't have to keep quitting to the overworld menu uh, in order to just restart the game if you restart the level it doesn't mean that you failed the level and you didn't die no the game just restarts it from the very beginning so if you never died it acts like you did uh, <clears throat> Oh, Leo. And I think the last time between the last level and this one, oh, hey. He incriminated his family? Like his aunt and his uncle. Dang it. His aunt and his uncle. Yeah, I gotta restart. Uh, his aunt, his uncle, and I think like his brother or something like that. If I'm not mistaken, but this game is oh so delightful. Ah, yes. And I still want that. I still want that. Um, no death bonus. Um, because I want to know the secret at the end. I really do. Which means that I actually have to play this game decently. Oh, oh goody. Oh, joy of joys. And I believe there's a part that sucks greatly after this one. Yeah, because this is, this is the baby part compared to the thing that I think I'm thinking about and remembering. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, okay. They're all the same distance. No! Oh! Whoa! Uh. Yes. <clears throat> See? This is what I get. That's exactly what I get. I'm talking, and I was... See? Just like now. I'm talking and thinking at the same time. Talking, thinking, and playing at the same time, which doesn't work. Which doesn't work. Not if you're going for like uh, the com <clears throat> excuse me, the completionist perfect run, <laughs> which is what I'm trying to do. Speaking of the completionist, oh my goodness, Gerard the completionist channel. What he does, what the team that he uh oh the team that he works with does it's amazing it's an awesome show and that just uh, things like that that he's one of those people on YouTube that make me go oh he only has now this is just a rough round about figure but it makes me go oh he only has a certain number of subs I think he's up to like a half million now, don't get me wrong, you know, a half million, 500,000 subs is fantastic. This looks a bit dangerous. Yeah, just a bit. And it's, it's amazing for anyone to achieve that. I would love, whoa, I'd love to be there one day. You know, whoa, to have at least like half a million subs, but, you know, He's one of those people where I'm like, dude, you do amazing work and you only have this many subscribers. You know. 
because I think that what you're doing is much is I think what you're doing is so amazing and so credible that you know I believe that you should have more subscribers um, and uh, but I've been watching a ton of uh, his stuff some kind of puzzle yeah the, the puzzles that I used to have as a child as a small child whoop um but yeah I just recently watched his uh his final fantasy seventh month and I got it my hats off to him because most people they would just say oh final fantasy seven whatever it is it, it, it. but I believe that he dang it he really and truly um did the series justice and the d-pad does indeed work now I remember that the d-pad does work okay um but yeah man just to see somebody who has the dedication uh in the drive to complete all these games and give oh this was it oh I know I know Leo I know <laughs> the way you look is the way I was feeling for a second there buddy alright I gotta figure uh, getting over is the easy part getting back that's the hard part and this is where I died last time. <clears throat> I remember all too well now. Uh, okay. I love it. Have I said how much I enjoy the voice acting in this game yet? And how much they actually give the character... The, that's a trend that I appreciate in gaming lately. Where... <clears throat> They make the main character of the game, uh... Oh! Oh, God. Oh, okay. That's the bad... Oh. Okay. No, I don't care. I'm not so much of a completionist where it's like, Oh my gosh, I gotta go ahead and, and get all three stars on camera. <laughs> I may go back and do that for me later. But I thought I was going to die. That's why I got silent at the end. Like, okay. But I like that they make the character. Oh. This looks a bit dangerous. This is just not fair. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Okay. Not cool, bro. Oh, oh, oh no. No! No! Uh, why did not think there were gonna be saws? Uh, 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 oh, oh, God. This, it made me forget everything nice that I was trying to say about Gerard the Completionist. But, I mean, he, whoa, hey, hey, whoa. Uh, why? Oh God! I knew it! I knew it! Why didn't I think there were gonna be saws? This reminds me of um, Prince of Persia too. But um, this looks a bit you know dangerous. to have the dedication to co completely ugh, complete uh. the game and get ugh, all the. Um, all the trophies and, and show people that it really can be done while giving a comprehensive impartial to a certain extent um, because come on we're, we're all human we all have our preferential biases um, that as impartial and as objective as we try to be are going to influence our decisions let's be realistic but you know whoa I think he does a fantastic job he and his team of you know, presenting weekly or like bi-weekly content. Uh, no. Oh no. This just isn't fair. 
Uh, I gotta shut up now. Uh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Is there anything down there? No. Uh. Uh. Oh, that's all you're gonna give me? No, I'm gonna die. Oh, I didn't die. Wow. That becomes so crucial right at the end. Yeah, I gotta push you. Oh no. Oh no. Uh. Oh, this is instant death, isn't it? Oh, okay. I made it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh, gosh. Not cool, bruh. Not cool. <clears throat> But, uh, uh, oh no, oh no, oh no, I see what they're go, uh, uh, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, uh, oh, no. uh, oh, okay. Uh -huh. Oh, wait. Why don't I trust you? I feel like, uh, some harm is gonna come to me by obeying these things. No! Oh, uh, no, really? I know, I'm sorry, Leo. We were doing so good, man. Uh, okay. Ugh. And it was through my own stupidity like this that one. Dangerous. I fully admit was my fault. Uh. No! I can't. I did the first one so well. I was doing so good, but then I became paranoid about that springboard. Like, this is not gonna end well. This and it did. Oh god. Dangerous. Gah. Okay. Okay. And a buh. Okay. But yeah, man. You know, I'm. I'm pleased to see that there can be that much creativity and ingenuity on a forum that's not like a dedicated website like uh, IGN. Don't get me wrong, I enjoy I enjoy IGN for what it is. You know, uh, I don't necessarily agree with, oh God, every sentiment that's expressed uh, about every single game, but hey, <clears throat> am I thankful that it's there and that it exists and that there's something out there for gamers that like a, a news website for gamers that you know does pretty well and knows their stuff and goes to well goes to conferences and stuff like that yes very much so and it's not like glitchy and as somewhat fragmented as the other gaming websites that are out there no don't die don't die oh how did i pull that off the first time that was the worst the first time uh, yeah. You know, this I love it so and I enjoy dangerous. it. Uh, how? He took a spike right to the head. Oh, gosh. Come on, Leo. We were doing so well before I tried to wax poetic. This looks a bit dangerous. Uh, oh, no, no. Uh, okay. I managed to slow him down a little bit during that one. Okay. And yeah, that Gerard, the completionist, the people over at thatonegamer.com, bravo. You guys do an excellent job of doing what you do and you make it wildly entertaining. And I am one of your fans. You know, I appreciate that. Now, that's not something that I would do personally. You know, because I don't think I have the patience for that. For oh my goodness, that saw took off some fur. It took it nicked his eyebrow just for a minute. <laughs> Gently caressed his back hairs. Oh, I get it. Huh. Oh, okay. I only made it last time because I was a lucky idiot. <laughs> uh, isn't that the story? 
Yeah, I'm glad there was like no golden coin. Oh, hey. Okay. Oh. Uh, okay. I remember that the best policy on that one was to just fall. Uh, come on. Uh, come on. Uh, okay. All right, now. Let's not be a stoop. Okay. Oh, God. Yep. No, no, don't, don't you, don't you start bouncing all willy-nilly. Okay, there's a way to do this. Yep. All right. And there we go. Okay, over a little bit. There we go, buddy. What's this now? I don't know. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Um Was I supposed to go with it or was I supposed to let it go? I don't know. Okay. Oh. Okay. All right. Uh I think I'm supposed to be sitting in it. Yes, I don't. I mean, I guess I'm supposed to ride in it and then jump out and get that cog. I think I can live without that cog. I think it'll be all right. As long as it gives me everything that I need to to get like, you got all the coins and you got a perfect. Clue Clay. I don't trust this. Okay, I can't trust this. Okay. It's one. It's two. Three. Okay. You know, if the cog is really something important, I'll go back and get it later. Uh-huh. Look at this. Do I just need to stay here? Oh boy. Oh no. No. This isn't fair. <laughs> Again. I'm gonna have to float through two of them, aren't I? Oh god. Oh, uh, bottom. Oh, uh, dude. You guys. You dicks. Yeah. No. No. Uh, game creators, why? Why? Uh, okay. Uh, uh, okay. 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 All right. 55 out of 55. No fatalities. Yeah, baby. No fatalities. Continuing. Uh, I don't know what that golden cog was there for, but I haven't heard anything about... Like, the only major thing that I heard about was, like, don't die. I approached Cousin Victor's port. He used to be a treasure hunter, splitting the oceans for fortune lost. But a violent storm tore his ship apart. We assumed he was torn as well. But he came back, barely living. He was himself a wreck after this. Hmm. Quiet at home with his wife and children. Hmm. He declined my offer to build him a new ship. I told him he should not fear to sail the oceans again. He told me I should go away and not come back. Wow. Now, perhaps his sight was set on the greatest treasure he never found. My gold. 
Okay. I mean, I can understand his apprehension about going out to sea. If you get caught in a bad storm... Oh, it's raining. Oh, look at the town in the background. That's adorable. I love rain. I love rain in games. And oh, I can even see the... Oh, I gotta go back up. No, what's up there? I want to know. Oh, it looks like a secret is up there. Oh. Look at it. Oh. Okay, so now I'm in the... Do I float? Okay. Ah. Oh, that's cool. No. No, no, no. I want to know what that golden... Ugh. Oh, can I... Mm-hmm. Uh, blah. Mm-hmm. Huh. Yep. Now I want that golden cog. Let's get it. Cog of the first plunge. Oh, so I get trophies for the cogs. Right. I don't want to test to see if he can drown. I just have to be careful. Because there may be spikes and other unmentionables down there. That I don't want poor Leo to get caught on. You know, the fallen debris. Come on. Come on. Why can't I get up there? Am I supposed to swim through the bottom? Come on. What is the deal here? Okay, bottom out and emerge. Uh huh. And uh huh. Yeah. That oddly enough took forever. And it, I didn't think it needed to, but uh, whatever. Alright, I'm surprised that as a little thing, as a little furball, he can get around like he can. Like, yeah, how are you swimming? But, don't get me wrong, this level, the music for this level is amazing. Can I get that box? No, okay. The music for this level is amazing. Yeah. Never doubt my love for this game. This game is awesome. Uh -huh. Oh, I almost panicked. Oh. This looks a bit dangerous. Oh, am I? Am I it? Wait, no, 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 no! <laughs> I had a Cleveland death. Oh, I gotta start over from the beginning. He even looks a little wet. But, God, I love, I love rain in general. It's been real rainy where I am because there was a hurricane passing by. Um... <laughs> yep, just passing by in the area. Well, it it's not going to touch the land, but uh, it's not going to make land fall. But it um oh, I like that sound effect. There's a lot I could learn from this game. Yeah, for a game that was originally, you know, just like uh, an iPhone game. I think that this is actually really well executed and I'm glad not about this part but I'm glad they ported this over to the PlayStation 4 really glad about that for anyone who is not aware um, and I apologize uh, I hadn't been doing it before but I am now uh, there's a link in the description uh, directing you <clears throat> to the PlayStation Store where I bought my copy. This game is only $6.99. dangerous. Uh, okay, I'm gonna use the D-pad for this one. I've been using the stick, uh -huh. Ha! Yeah! Angry Birds, my foot. Happy Leo it is. Wait, is that it for the level? Hopefully. Chase? 
Nah, it couldn't be that simple. And indeed, I would be disappointed if it were that simple. Like, oh no! Yeah, let's swim for it. Um. Um. So, push this over here. Yeah, uh. Did I screw the pooch? Did I screw? Oh no, no, no. That's, that's what I have to do. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I think that it's a wonderful, wonderful port and an awesome game, and I'm, I'm glad they did what they did for the game. Um, come on. Uh, I'm forgetting the controls as I'm playing. Like, why isn't he going down? Uh, huh. Okay. Now, to submerge and reemerge. Gah. Get, get, gah. You'll feel my wrath. Gah. Yes, the wrath of Leopold. Let's go, Leo. Dude, if I could push things like that while treading the surface of water, I'd be so strong. Nice. Why, thank you. I'm so glad you noticed. Ah, oh, no. Yep, highlighted in red, meaning that's death. There are the spikes that I was so worried about. And this is a bone yard. This isn't just a ship graveyard. Like, are those dragon bones? They're something. And whatever that something is, it's big. Oh, dinosaur bones. Ah, oh, I love it. Ah. Oh. Speaking of dinosaurs, has anyone seen, uh, has anyone seen Jurassic Park? The Lost, what is it? Lost World? Lost Planet? New Age? I can't remember, but I wanted to go see it a couple of weeks ago, and, uh, hmm. Oh, wait. Those are spikes. Okay. Ah. Yep. I'm so glad I took notice before I made that tremendous mistake it would have been highly upset like dang it why didn't I know about the spikes wait is that the way out of the level uh, couldn't be could it um uh okay I don't know I'm not quite sure what the purpose of this is, but there was a box down here, and I am going to keep pushing said box till I get it up, because this seems like the right thing to do, and this looks like a puzzle. And I already got the cog, so I don't know, you know what else I can possibly get here, but hey, as long as Leo's strong enough to push that through sh oh that's the box to help me jump up oh okay well look at me I'm doing it I'm doing it no nah, I took way too long I took five minutes oh man all right so I got two out of the four stars required for that one I think I only need three stars for that one but I got eight Two out of the 74, that's going to be five, and I think six, seven, eight. So, Cousin of Victor's Law. So, okay, okay, I'm going to cut the video here. I beat three levels, three levels in one video. I'm so proud of myself. Um, and no fatalities recorded on the game just yet. So, I'm very, very pleased about that. I guess that second star is the no fatality star. Third one is the time limit. So, okay, very cool, very cool. So, thank you so much for joining me. I guess, I guess I may talk about uh, Jurassic Park: The Lost World. I think it's The Lost World next time. Uh, yeah, I may talk about that the next time if I remember. So, thank you so much for joining me again. Uh, if you liked it, enjoy it. You know, this is part of the weekend series where we're just going to sit back, we're just going to relax and have a good time, play some good games, and just 
just cool out, you know? Um, and I'm the outlier, and I will see you all in the next video.